just doing a bit of work. Uh, does this make sense to you? No? Oh god, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. I've got all the food on this wrong, and I, and I knew that that is not the kind of correct blood to use. I, I just... Oh, right, because you... Because you don't speak fey. Sorry, I, uh... I'm just dealing with something. Give me a sec. Using, but essentially, you take the blood of a criminal who's been hanged, and uh, you water an enchanted uh, groundling seed with that. And you give it here, and the whole scene look up. So, you take the, the, the criminal's blood and you water the seed and plant it in unconsecrated ground. And then from that, uh, you can begin to create a mandrake bulb, which kind of resembles just a, a uh, regular bulb with these three distinct leaves growing out the top. And most people pick at this point for potions, but if you allow the mandrake to mature into a full-grown entity, they tend to be semi-aggressive, uh, majoritively, this book says, enticive. I think that means that the plant flirts with you. It's, it's a lot. I'm trying to fit all these notes onto one page, because we're only allowed one piece of parchment to go into the test with. Do you know that we're doing a foreign exchange program of sorts? So, the Fey realm is sending students to the Central Plain, specifically to the Church of Knowledge which apparently is the number one school for, uh, you know, magic within that plane. So I'm gonna have to go there to sort that out. Lord have mercy. This looks good. Huh? Oh, that's a an uh, anatomical drawing of a m mandrake. What's the problem? Well, yeah, they, they, they usually have six packs. Is that a problem? Eight pack, maybe? No, you... Okay. Well, I already started drawing, so I'm gonna finish it. Uh, who's that in the corner? Uh, that's, uh... That's Prince Oberon. I'm taking up valuable space by drawing him, actually, but... I, I've been trying to do as a little side hobby a uh, little caricature, so I'll just erase that. Uh, I don't know. I've been thinking about him a lot, to be honest. Thinking about how he pr probably wants to be dead. Because I stole that book. That's fine, that's fine. He doesn't know it was me. He couldn't. Plus, I don't know. There's a lot of things going on, to be honest. Just let me work in peace. God. And after that, and then I have to do another page of notes, and then after that, it just never seems to end in a continuous loop. Oh, God. 
All right. Okay. I'm gonna have to ask your help on this one. Tell me how this sounds. El coro que skin. Que velo. My chip brush. Oh no. You're right, it's all trash. It sounds terrible. I need to start over again. Damn, I really thought. Oh yeah, because you can't speak Faye. Sorry, sorry, I keep asking. I'm gonna start over again. I'm just. I'm gonna start over again. I'm just gonna toss that away. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Everything's fine. It's just about a lot going on in my life, you know? If it's not this work, then it's personal matters. And if it's not personal matters, then it's just internal fears. And there was a thing recently. So I've been seeing this, this moonbeam court fay, and we were getting on real great, and I was sharing my study notes and everything, and things turned out to be great, but then recently they've just stopped sending me letters, and, and, and I know letters take a long time to reach from one side of the fay wild to the other, but I just feel like at this point I should be getting something in response, but then I feel like if I respond, like send out messages, I feel like a needy friend, you know? Maybe I am a needy friend. I start my project. Yes, we restart. Focus my mind on my work. Hmm. Yeah. Well, I got to sleep. Uh, what's the sundial say? Two days ago, apparently. this done, I'll feel better, you know, it's, it's, it's just, it's a lot right now, and I just can't, it's just a lot, sometimes I feel like, sometimes I feel like all this work is just overbearing, I don't know where I'm going in life, I waste all this time and energy trying to feel better, but but it's just not good enough, and it'll never be good enough because I need to, I need to, I need to. What's this? What what are you doing? Why are you hugging me? I don't, I don't understand. <sighs> Thanks. That's, that's really nice. Maybe I should just try and let go. You know, it's still technically work if I show you my garden that I'm working on right now, right? I mean, I am studying my herbology degree so I can eventually wa work in the ro royal court. I know, it's a dumb dream, especially since I hit the prince over the head with a book. I don't really think about that at the time, but I doubt he remembers it's me. And violence is a good way to get what you want. If there's anything I've learned from my schooling time, violence is the key. Yes. Always. Huh? Sorry, no. Uh, got carried away there. Where am I? Where, where, what's going on? 
Go to bed. Why would I go to bed? There's no need to go to bed. No, no, no. I'm not. I'm not going to bed. Everything's fine. Who said that? It was me. I said that. I said that. I'm fine. I don't need to go to bed. Who said the bed? Do you want to go to bed with me? What are you saying? Who said that? I'm gonna. You yeah, stay up a little while longer. I'm gonna. Just, I ran out of parchment. I'm gonna write on your face. Come here. I'm gonna write. I'm gonna write on your face. Artwork in this video was by Mo. Thank you.